When you substitute and there are brackets involved, all that's different is that you must follow the rules where you do brackets first, multiplying and dividing after that, and adding and subtracting last. So let's have a look at this one here. In my expression, I've got 5a plus 5 multiplied by the bracket, a plus 3 multiplied by d. So I'll put the multiplications in. You can see that even though there's nothing between this 5 and the bracket, that's really multiplied. There's nothing between this 3 and the d, that's really multiplied. So now that I've actually got it in a, in the more expanded form, I can actually then put the numbers in, do the substitution. So 5 multiplied by a. a is 4, so I put 4 instead of a plus 3 multiplied by d, d is 2, so I put 2 where the d was. Now, in this case here, I have to do what's in the brackets first, so I'll just keep the 5 here for a minute, until I need it, and inside the brackets, there are two things, there's a multiplication and addition, you must do the multiplication first, so multiplication comes before addition. So, I'll keep the 4, and the plus, and 3 twos are 6. Now, I still need to finish the bracket off before I do anything else. Even though multiplication is more powerful or needs to be done before addition, I must finish the bracket off first because brackets take precedence. So let's have a look. I'm going to have 5 multiplied by bracket. 4 plus 6 is 10. And I don't need the brackets anymore because there's only one single number in there. So it's really just 5 times 10, which is 50.